What's up everybody? Once again, it's Brand Man Sean and today we're going over the DNA of a hit song and really just music that connects with your audience using that boy Marshmallow as an example. If you don't know Marshmallow, he's a music producer and DJ mostly associated with EDM music and his hit song alone is one of the greatest examples of how how you could blow up and really connect with fans. I really encourage you to watch the song and video because we're going to talk about it here. But here's the DNA of that song. Number one, when he speaks of this song, he said how lonely he felt at the time he was away from his family. He wrote from how he feels. I've talked about that before. Writing from a true place, an authentic place, is usually going to connect with other people because other people have felt those same emotions. Our emotions are not as unique as we like to make them feel. There are billions of people out there who have felt the same thing before. And as an artist, use that to your advantage. And then this man comes back with this crazy video. Not only is it interesting from the standpoint of you know his whole aesthetic with the mask and all this kind of stuff and how he uses that branding throughout the whole video oh my god it's brilliant the actual arc of the story he tells that was lonely particularly in his school days and everybody has felt lonely no matter how popular they get or are everybody's felt lonely at some point and when you go back into school days that's a familiar place to everybody because pretty much everybody has been to school some form of school even if they didn't get to high school people have been to elementary school at least. Think about a time when you felt lonely. Even if you don't connect with the music, you could watch the video and probably feel some connection with it. And then the arc of the video is this beautiful story of the fact that the guy was alone, but then being alone, he actually found himself, which was through music and became popular because of it, which is a metaphor for the fact that your authentic self is what would allow you to win at the end of the day. That's something that people can relate to, whether they're musicians or just whatever the hell they're doing. And there's nothing deeper than that. We're not talking about just popular music, but we're talking about especially creating true fans, not forgettable stuff, but stuff that you remember and feel forever when you hear it, it takes you back to a place that's the kind of connection that people really support you for and then as a bonus let's throw in the familiarity of that dun, 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 dun. like there's a background if you listen to the song there's this voice in the background singing and the cadence the sonic the sound feels like the late 1990s the early 2000s that rock music of that time where it makes you want to play Tony Hawk Pro Skater or something like that familiarity is a powerful element through school through the voice and the music I don't know how intentional he was about the familiarity, but when it's there, it works. That's why lazy pop music just uses pretty much the same beats and things like that because they're just using familiarity to get through the door. And now let me just play this man speaking for himself. He's gonna basically say everything I said and condense, but I just broke it down. Here he be. Well, that song started when I first went off on tour and I left all my friends and family at home and I was feeling pretty alone on the road and I decided what better idea than to write a song about how I was feeling. What was the inspiration behind the storyline for the music video? Um, in the beginning, Marshmallow was an outcast in school. He was alone and ironically, how he became big in school was doing something alone, which was what music and, and with the helmet and staying true to who he was. Right, and in the music video, he kind of went from being bullied to being loved for his music. That's it. You know what to do? Hit that subscribe button. 